Okay, so I just beat the game Final Fantasy XV, and I just want to say this was probably one of the best games I've ever played in my entire life. I'm not being biased because I am a Final Fantasy fan, but honestly, for, for probably like three to four years, I've been playing video games on my on PS4 and Xbox, and I haven't really been satisfied. Like, sometimes I'll, I'll like the game maybe for a week, and then I'll get bored of it. This game, I was literally entranced for the whole time playing it and the thing about this game compared to all the other games is that it just invoked emotion like it invoked so much emotion on you like it there's times when it will literally make you cry those times that it will literally make you just feel for the character because the character even though the main story the main character was a, a guy you know as you can see him right here is his name is noctis but it's also about a brotherhood of four different characters that are on the journey and everything about this game was amazing the graphics was amazing the story was amazing the the game the game strategies and the, the villains every little thing was amazing honestly this game was to me i would give it a 10 out of 10 the only reason why I wouldn't give it a 10 out of 10 because it is due probably because like some some characters needed more backstories and you know they needed more cutscenes in it. But besides that, I don't, I don't know how you, this is like I don't know how you can make a better game than this. And a uh, Final Fantasy 7 is coming out pretty soon, so I'm not sure. Hopefully, it has it has a huge task to beat. To, to be better than this game and I don't know if it really could because I think Final Fantasy 15 was an amazing game it's the type of game where this is a game where it's so good that you don't want to play it again because you just have so much emotion in the game it's, you don't want to play it's not that you don't want to play it again because it's because it's you beat it and it's going to be boring if you play it again no it's like you really feel for the characters it's like it's like watching a TV show and you just develop. it's like watching you know, when the kids, when they watch the old school, not really old school, but the late 90s, early 2000s, Cartoon Network and Nickelodeon, where you're so entranced by the different characters, robots, you know, um, Dexter's Laboratory, Ed and Nettie, Hey Arnold, like these shows, like they're just cartoons that someone made, but you just love them and you just, you have a bond with those characters because you've, you've been watching and you respect that craft. That's the same thing with this game. This game, you just respect it. You just respect this game, and honestly, in my opinion, man, this is one of the best games I ever played in my life. Um, I, I'm gonna say the creator of Final Fantasy 15, well done, and um, I hope that Final Fantasy 7 will be much better. Anybody who's never played Final Fantasy game in their life before, I would advise you play this game first because this game was easy easy to play it wasn't difficult it wasn't complicated everything was amazing the combat strategies was amazing um the the, the weapons were awesome you know this game this type of game where it's it's similar to like grand theft auto mixed in with um fable like it was amazing like the the game's uh, area was wide you can you can literally be walking around for hours just going to the next town. You know, it, it was an amazing game. It was never ending. Even when you beat the game, there's still more side quests. There's still more missions. There's still more villains. There's villains that are even better, better or tougher than the biggest boss in this game right over here. So, like, this game, in my opinion, had an amazing story. Um, amazing story. It's type... And the thing about this this series was so good is because they also had an animation series. They had a movie series to it. Uh, they had an animation series called Brotherhood that you can actually watch on YouTube and to follow up on it. And they also had um, a movie called King's Glaive you could watch. So um, this game was a pretty amazing man. Honestly, I, I'll say it's well done. Um, this surpassed my... Um, my expectations. I thought this game would just be a decent game to play and I'll just beat it and I'll be on to the next one. No, I was literally gravitated. It was so good that I even bought the soundtrack to the game because the orchestra and the soundtrack of the game was amazing. This orchestra 
and the soundtrack to the game, I would give it a 20 out of a 10. It was beyond your expectation completely. There was no flaw in the orchestra, the soundtrack. It was literally an album that I literally paid money just to listen to over and over and over again. Every single thing about this game was good. Well done. Well done. Well done. When I beat the game, I literally was in tears. And I'm that I'm serious. There's games there's never been a game where I literally this is the first game where I really just loved it and I just felt had an emotional attachment to it. I don't think I've ever had a, an emotional attachment to a game in a long while. I don't think I've ever had an attachment to a game. Period. Period, yeah. I don't think I've ever got maybe no, I don't think so. This is the first game, yeah. Like, I'm a huge Madden head, but it doesn't really attach me to it. You know, I played a lot of games. A lot of Metal Gear, Call of Duty. I played almost every single Final Fantasy series. Yeah, my favorite series was also Final Fantasy Seven, but it wasn't like this. This was something that... It was more than a game. This When you're playing this game, it's like you're literally watching a movie as you play. That's why it's so beautiful when you play it. It's, the playing is just... It's really... The playing is really more subjective to actually just watching the game. You sometimes This is the type of game where you would actually watch your friends play and you would still love it. That's how beautiful this game was, man. So beautiful. Well done, guys. Well done.